Welcome to Paki News Network. You must be wondering what's happening in Pakistan. Imran Khan's led PTI party has jammed most of the Punjab province where it enjoys power. PTI protesters under protection of police blocked highways in Rawalpindi city, along with roads leading to the international airport in the motorways. As a result all educational institutions had to be shut for three days for safety of kids. Imran Khan launched a long march from Punjab province to the federal capital and threatened that it could turn into a bloody revolution as an Islamic Republic of Iran. What does Khan want? He wants immediate snap elections. This is the second time Imran is using street power to threaten the center to hold early elections. This is the only reason given by this power-hungry cricketer can play boy with three wives. Here you can see a bastard Raja Basharat belonging to Imran Khan's PTI party enjoying a cricket match while sitting in the center of a road that connects business centers of Rawalpindi. Welcome to Paki News Network. This is part two of what's happening in Pakistan. Viewers, the only institution in Pakistan that is currently supporting Imran Khan's led PTI party is the Supreme Court and the Islamabad High Court. Here you can see how serious they are in saving the Federation of Pakistan. They prefer watching cricket match instead of upholding the rule of law. Viewers, Federation of Pakistan comprises four provinces. In this map, you can see that Punjab and KP provinces where Imran Khan enjoys majority and assemblies are supporting his long march aimed at attacking Islamabad which Khan has himself admitted that it could turn into a bloody revolution like Iran had witnessed. 